Hey everyone, Rob here, and uh, we got a breaking news kind of thing. Uh, I posted the last video, we're talking about how the eruption is sort of confined to the cone and it's not overflowing, but as I posted that, seemingly the northern part of the crater collapsed uh, at 11.26 today, and as a result, the magma is flowing now towards the north. Uh, we have a video here from the MBF cam, uh, which is the, one of the news agencies here in Iceland, where you can see this unfold uh, and as we play it. So this was all confirmed by Mini Sigurdóttir, a natural hazard expert at the Icelandic Meteorological Office in an interview that she had with MBET or MBL.is, the news agency here. Uh, there was a little flow from it onto the north side. Uh, on the main side, the flow continues as it has been flowing since you know, the last couple of days for sure, but it has subsided on the north now. Um, the eruption is still running its usual course. Uh, it's not slowing down. She, do, she does want to note, though, that it can become very dangerous when the crater collapses like this. And uh, those of you who are around the eruption area, be sure to be mindful of staying out of the danger zone as police and rescue teams have defined it. You don't want to be standing there when part of this cone collapses and then you have lava flowing 100 meters uh, much quicker than you can outrun it. So be mindful of that, stay out of the danger zone. And uh, there was some posts about sort of the activity slowing down, uh, but Mini Sigurd Dr. she says, when the crater collapses like this, the eruption drops considerably but it rises again when the crater and the lava and the magma all reach equilibrium again. So it has not stopped. Uh, there's no signs that any of the activity is slowing down or speeding up. It's kind of remaining consistent. Uh, it's just part of it collapsed, as you can see here in the video. And uh, yeah, stay out of the danger zone. On other news, as we let this play, uh, we mentioned one of the search and rescue team members flipped an ATV or four-wheeler uh, while on one of the paths. News updated on that. It is a broken arm, not as serious as was initially thought, which is great news on that front. So good thing that uh, nothing serious came out of that. Broken arm, of course, uh, we want to avoid all injuries or injuries as much as possible at the eruption site. want to make it as pleasurable and fun and exciting as they can, uh, given the circumstances, that this is a very dangerous natural disaster and uh, that shouldn't be taken lightly. So that's it for the updates. Video of it collapsing here from the MBF cam. Again, it was uh, just before lunchtime today. So until next time, thank you so much for watching.